The heavens forbid but that our loves and comforts should increase, even as our days do grow. Does he know how much you love him? Who was it I loved? It's, it's the company. I would like you, please, to lead Miss Parkinson and the rest of Slytherin House from the hall. All my pupils are the creme de la creme. Give me a girl at an impressionable age, and she is nine for life. I've come to claim her. I'm Mrs. Medlock, housekeeper at Misselthwaite Manor. You see, I... Well, I've looked after children all my life. Now, do I remind you of Mary Poppins? No, I wouldn't say so. That spoonful of sugar put my profession back 50 years. You mustn't be frightened. In the house is bound to share some secrets. But you mustn't be scared. No, I don't want to see the rest of the house. I, I didn't come prepared for a guided tour. Yes, let me... Oh, let me speak! Be brief, dear mother, for I am in haste. A grievous burden was your birth to me. And came I not at last to comfort you? You came on earth to make the earth my hell. I'm abnormal. I can't see how I can be, can you? Do I act down? Not exactly. It's, it's just that while you're nervous sometimes, and well, I, I, I think I make it worse for you. Worse for me? What do you mean? How am I nervous? So now I'm an outsider who need not be consulted. Since you put it like that, yes. Any particular reason? Thousands for when you beat me out to be the most stupid, childish, meddling, naive, stupid You're child. You're repeating yourself. Why? Captain never, never happened. Maura! Grant, I'm gonna go get Maura. Did I have tried to tell you so many times? Give us a cup of tea, ready. Well, I knew you would have forgotten. What is she doing? Writing. Can anything be done about it? Would you like some of this? I believe it's called Alu Carparata. Now, if I can't pronounce it, I don't want to eat it. Get up! Get up! Just you imagine what a hero you'll be! Blowing up old ladies! They'll give you the iron cross for that! I'm shameless, but I say it. I love you, Johnny. What is music, then? Then music is even as the flourish when true subjects bow to a new throned monarch. It's all right, Ursula. I don't understand. Because she didn't no, know. No, I don't understand. Why? Now, do you understand? One of the unsolved mysteries of life, or one of the unsolved mysteries of my life, is why the vicar's wife has to go to church at all. If I were only ten years younger... And alive. Me being alive was never our problem. Either. You being alive was a problem. You were on your last legs when I put your chestnuts out of the fire. No, no, don't be alarmed. This is not a cold. It's just a slight cough. I've had it for three days. It has nothing to do with sitting on the ground. <laughs> oh, yes, let me come play. Isn't that nice? Come on. Yeah. I'll get the bus tonight, Mr. Napole, if it's all the same to you. It gets me straight there, see? Oh, any, um, any particular time? What for? Oh, no. No, I'm easy. The Bible is full of sex. Haven't you noticed? The Bible? Mm -hmm. Well, I think you're very generous. Oh, I am. Mm. I don't understand. 
man. Why would anybody want to steal a dead, naked body? Well, dear, there are people who... Um... Oh, that's tacky. That's really tacky. Why, once he even tried to ravish me, disguised as a cuttlefish. Did he succeed? Certainly not. Oh, so you married him to keep his spirits up at the end? I suppose I did, yes. Well, forgive me, but that doesn't sound unloving. To me, that sounds as if you loved him a great deal. I'm very much afraid, ma'am, that I have nothing to add. Nothing, Mr. Pierpoint Edwards? If you mean you're afraid of being a bother, put that right out of your head. I'm used to it. H.J. is always rescuing some young genius or the other and installing them in here. And anybody, and anybody so much as gives you a kind word. And that's your prince. Sent to keep you from being alone. And I love, don't I? That's forgotten. Come back at half past eight. I'll get dressed. Gracious bore, of course. I don't want to miss anything. Years. Well, a little time, yes. Years. <laughs> he doesn't get a lot of things. Are oh. you finished? Oh, yeah. I'm done. Take the fork. <clears throat> fork. Oh! What do I care? This town is filled with rich old widows willing to pay for a little groveling and a body massage. You go ahead and fire me. Excuse me. Absolutely not. I couldn't possibly. 